Hello, I'm Martin Fenska and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Battle Brothers. So today we will start by attacking some nomads in this debris of ancient times. We learned a little bit about the location in Azim Sh Azim Sham. So uh, we know that there are um, there are nomads there, and that means this should be a good opportunity for our new guys to get some experience. So I'm taking all three of them. Uh, I just hope that we won't run into something crazy like multiple assassins, executioners, things like that. Once we are done here, we'll be heading south, check this island, and then uh, I think I want to check the adventures end, uh, just in case the garrison change there. There may be a bit more exploring here, get rid of uh, this fog of war, and then I think I'll return back to Azim Shab and sail to Quadim. I'm not 100% certain about that. Um, I'm still thinking that maybe we could walk through Rassanan and then stay in Quadi maybe for... Actually, no, I, I said that uh, uh, this is not going to be our, our base of operation. I decided to... Uh, to go to Helleborg to set up a base, so we want to build up reputation up here. Okay, fine. That that solves the issue. We can, we don't have to like try to get to Quadim last. We can just go there, then to Rasanan and just leave, get north, and then we're gonna stay in the north and start working on the reputation. Okay, well. That makes it much easier. <clears throat> so let's attack. Uh, 12 serpents, I think I'll pass. There's, I don't think there is any reason to fight those. Um, this doesn't look too bad. So our archers will just take a break. Everyone else can just end the turn. Okay, Meinolf may have to move back. Uh, he really is not doing that well against multiple archers. Or maybe he can just move one tile forward. I forgot that, the, that nomads are actually much more aggressive than bandits and then they tend to move forward immediately. Uh, I'll just move a little bit. Hit him. Good. Wait. I'm trying to kill him. There we go. Do we need to disarm anyone? I mean, we could. Why not? Try to disarm. It didn't work anyway. Um, but there was no reason not to try. Uh, what are we looking at here? I'd like to hit some of the archers, but it's not gonna happen. This is... oh, this is not even an outlaw. Okay, well, I'll just hit as many things as possible. I probably accidentally... Uh, uh, sh uh, like aimed at this guy with the first shot. I'm a little distracted because I'm hearing some weird now weird noises in the background. I don't think that the mic is picking it up, but um, it's uh, I'm pretty sure it's Schmudla. Sometimes she just goes completely nuts for no reason. Uh, just starts running around and I don't know how to call the sound it's definitely not some a sound that the cat should be making like growling um, if you heard that I'm not sure if the mic is, uh, could pick it up or not in the background but it really sounds like like I don't know a tiger or something and sometimes she actually starts climbing the curtains while she's doing this, so uh, I'm trying to figure out what's going on behind me. Uh, 
Now let's try to get the killing frenzy here. Nope. We can still try. Nope. Wanted to get killing frenzy up and then attack the other one. Hmm, that's too far. I'm pretty sure you heard that. And she's gone. Try to get a kill here. I would like to get some kills for our new guys. Uh, let's move this way so that we are actually no, let's move this way so that we are standing on the high ground. I didn't want to stand next to it, but we had enough movement to go all the way. Uh, you will die, you will panic. That's good. And can we one, two, three? I can jump all the way here to block them. Sounds good. And then maybe wait here, see what happens. Mm, this should be fine, probably. We don't want to expose the new guys too much because their defense sucks. May as well. Nice. Come on. Oh, horrible. Here, we, we are taking too much damage. Such an easy fight. And the stun. Not sure if I want to move forward and get hit once again here. I'm probably gonna step back. Okay, good. So he panicked. Now we want to. Ah, uh, that was a misclick once again. What am I doing? movement do we have let's go here next turn I'll attack at least one archer don't really have a target now Nice shooting. Uh, I think that's fine. As long as we don't miss all of our attacks. That was a good one. 
Uh, I actually wanted to stab him to death, get the armor, but I think before... We only have one assassin with us, so before he gets there, we would take way too much damage, so I'll just start attacking. Uh, nope. You missed almost everything last turn. That's good. Okay, how many of them panicked? These three... There's six in the fight, okay. I will have to stop recording and check what my cats are doing. Because uh, usually the noise lasts only for like one or two minutes and then they just give up. But this time it's been going for a while and that usually means they found something really interesting. And I'm a little nervous what it might be. Someone please hit something it would be great. I could still stab him to death now. No, oh, too late. I hope this was worth it. I mean, we got two level ups, that's nice. Uh, the one is for Walker, it's, that's not that great. Uh, but we took a lot of damage, so... 11 tools and supplies and nothing else, so this wasn't worth it at all. Okay, let's check the level ups. And then I'll have to check my cats. So this one, that's gonna be defense for sure, stamina and hit points, I would say. And then here. Okay, so we are going heavy armor. Uh, but I think before I take Battleforge, I'll take Berserk, those extra four action points. That usually means one extra attack. So I go Berserk, Battleforged, into Killing Frenzy, and then we'll see. I'm cursed. What do we take here? I mean, sure, I could take plus four resolve. It's not complete waste. I'm probably gonna do it. I don't know what else I take. I was even thinking about taking the plus one defense. I 
Did we get plus one every single time? I mean, there is a range, even with no stars, there is a range that you get between one and three. So it should average plus two for normal people. For me, I'm averaging like 1.1. Okay, changes. Or do we need to make changes? This should be repaired quickly. This is fine. 66. Uh, I mean, we don't want to fight the snakes. We want to explore for a bit. This is actually the biggest problem. These two. I, I mean, no, these two. Uh, it's going to take a while. And this is, this is fine. Uh, maybe we can stay like this. Okay, so there's nothing here. Oh, there is something there. Uh, let's actually check the rest of the island. And we're gonna do the fight last. Okay, so here we don't know what we're gonna be fighting. We knew it here because we had the information from Azim Shah. Here we are going in blind. Um, I don't think there can be ghosts, so I'm not taking Grimwald for this. But there definitely could be skeletons, which means we probably want to take the strongest team that we currently have available. So that's not you and not you. Um, how are we doing on the repairs? 80? I guess I will be taking archers with me because we don't know what we have against. It can be, I think it can be skeletons or it can be nomads again. So, I think this is the team that kind of works against both. If it's skeletons, we can send probably these three around. And if it's nomads, then we are fine. I'm not sure if it could be something like... Probably could be like something like snakes or ifrits or something like that. I don't think we can... We can get the better team for the fight. Okay, give me a second, I have to check on my kids, as I said. Okay, I'm back, I apologize for the interruption, but I just had to make sure that uh, everything is everything is fine. Uh, so, deserted towers, let's jump in. I did change everything. Yeah, this is probably the strongest team that we can take. Okay, skeletons. That's quite a lot of skeletons. 18. Huh. Let's have a look. Not that many pikes. These two don't really deal any damage, so that's four that we have to uh, keep an eye on. Well, so everyone waits. We have unfortunately three archers, which is not the best for this fight. But we can still use them 
uh, for overwhelm stacks, that's one option. And then also maybe damage or destroy armor. If we get an opportunity. Okay, so we can try to disarm this one. And I think... I'm just gonna move back. And spread out a little bit. Actually... No, I'll just think. I was thinking about preparing to attack this one, but before I'd be able to do really anything to him, is already gonna be engaged in melee. I'm pretty sure. So you stay. You stay. Wait. Okay, so now everybody's out of the cloud. I probably should have moved Friedrich somewhere else. Wait, wait. Okay, I have to get somewhere else. not bad. Oh, so close. He's dazed. That's something. But usually with skeletons until are dead, they are dangerous. Wait. Seventy-eight. You can do it. Uh, not bad. So we need killing frenzy, and then we should start getting those one shots. Uh, we can see how close it is without killing frenzy. Yeah, this is what I was talking about. Even though he's dazed, he still managed to hit easily. Um, let's break the shield. Sixty four, sixty, sixty four. Damn it. Good. Now, how do we do this? I think I need to kill the pikemen first. They are just too dangerous. Are the wrong ones. Nice. 
Nice. Holy crap. That was unexpected. Now, what I need is to jump here. And uh, as far as I know, there is no way to do that. He'll always jump here. Actually, no. Surprise. Nice. Okay, good. We can finish this one off before he can attack. We can kill this one. That is a nice surprise. I kind of expect it to be stuck here with that, with that uh, uh, shield bearer uh, for like next four rounds. Come on. There we go. Don't fail. Excellent. This isn't bad at all. May even jump into the cloud. Get ready for next turn with the AoE. I'm glad that the other guards decided not to join, that we can split this fight basically into two. First this group and then we'll take care of the of the other guards and the priest. Excellent. I just keep stacking up overwhelm here maybe. I think if I want to try and one of these to do some damage to the arm, or what I could do actually at this point probably is move forward and start working on the other guards. Nice. Just jumping out of the cloud. I don't want to move towards this group yet, especially not with just one one person. Um, wait. Okay, we don't need the AoE. I'll just go single target. And that's fine, these guys still have full life. Um, it was intentional, I knew that I was standing next to a skeleton, but I want to get closer to this one. Wow. Holy crap, dude, that was pretty good. Hmm. Fortunately, he's in the center of the poison. I'll just stay. Start working on this shield. Nice. Hmm. 
Okay, wait. I can switch to a cleaver, I think. If we need more damage. Probably won't. Wait. I'm surprised that the other guards are not moving at all. I'll probably get hit now. Oh, or maybe not. Now I just need to do it so that we take as little damage as possible. That's an interesting move. Okay, spread out. That's not bad. So what's it gonna do? It's fine. The rotation is a little annoying. Ah, come on. I was really hoping this would be a kill. Uh, he has uh, so many overwhelm stacks that he shouldn't be able to hit anything. Okay, it wasn't too bad. We didn't even, didn't even take that much damage, but um, we got lucky with the uh, with the pikemen. There were only four, the dangerous ones, so it wasn't that difficult. Uh, killing some of them early, keeping the rest disarmed, and that's a shiny shield. This could be a pretty good one. That's a unique version of the. Of the southern shield those usually have really high durability 18 oh. it's actually quite bad I'll have to compare it to what we are currently using but I think 
think we got unlucky. What's the durability? 32, so that's a pretty significant difference. The plus four stamina though is a problem. This is only 14, this one is 18. So this one is definitely better. And this gives us plus three melee defense. It's it's not great. I think it's a small upgrade over the kite shield, but pretty sure there are much better shields in the game. We definitely need plus twenty. Or uh, plus 20. We need 20 plus to melee defense on the shield for our tanks. And that uh, minus 18, 18 fatigue is just too much. Minus 3 uh, fatigue when we use a shield is nice. Uh, but we don't use the shield that often. We do taunt. We do rotation. But we rarely do things like um, shield wall or knockback. So the last line doesn't come into play that often. But it's shiny. I'll take it. Okay, one, two. Wait, this is... Prony Battleforged. Okay, so uh, one, two, three. Okay, so we are done with this island. Now, let's check if there is something here. Uh, come on. Let's wait until the morning. I wonder if you will see all the way. I can see all the way. This is basically the same thing that we were facing here, but um, we got pretty lucky with uh, with the pikemen, as I said. That's all it's about. Plus, we didn't have some other guards. This was only few. Some can be up to six. And with if if. Um, with six other guards, if there were six, some of them would fight right from the start, and other guards with shields are such a pain in the ass. Yeah, I think I'll pass. It's definitely doable. It's just I can't guarantee that uh, we would win that without losses. Really? Unknown garrison? There we go. Okay, that's too many as well.
So that was a waste of time. How much food do we have? Food... Uh, also, tools and supplies are pretty low, so we need both. <clears throat> oh, hey, there is something here. I wanted to say, let's just climb the mountain. If you don't see anything, we'll head for Azim Shab. But we did spot something, so I think that's our target for the next episode. Once again, it could be here. It could probably even be even be brigands because it's right on the edge of the desert and the savanna. I'm not sure. This could probably even be ghosts. I mean, ghosts, undead with ghosts. What does that mean? Who stays behind? I think this will have to be the team for the off chance that we run into ghosts. Oh well, that's going to be next time. We are done with this episode, so I hope that you liked it. I hope that you're going to join me next time again. Now until then, have a good time. Bye-bye.